it was the coldest winter ever. Many animals died because of the cold. The hedgehogs, realizing the situation, decided to group together to keep warm. This way they were covered and protected themselves. The only problem was that the quills of each one wounded their closest companions. After a while, they decided to distance themselves one from the other, and they began to die, alone and frozen. So they had to make a choice. Either accept the quills of their companions or disappear from the earth. Wisely, they decided that if they were going to survive this deadly cold, they would have to come together and learn to get along, despite their various quirks and prickly ways from time to time, that always come about in close situations. They needed the warmth from each other to be able to survive. They needed to care for each other. There will always be differences when they can get a little prickly about things, but they could all compromise a little for the benefits that come from a close relationship. They learned to live and adjust themselves with the little wounds caused by the close relationship with their companions. But they also enjoyed the heat that came from the others. This way they were able to survive. Other animals soon saw what the hedgehogs were doing, and began doing the same thing despite their differences, and many were able to survive the devastating and deadly cold that had come upon them. Instead of fighting and arguing over their differences and imperfections, consider the good qualities and build on those things. This is a story that has been passed down by the Native Americans for eons of time. My friends, living with people's perfection is easy, living with another person's imperfection is tough, but that is something we must all do to live together, because there is no such thing as a perfect person. The best relationship is not the one that brings together perfect people, but when each individual learns to live with the imperfections of others and can admire the other person's good qualities. Thanks for watching and stay safe always. Hello guys, my name is Adam. I know that every country in the world have their own amazing short stories that teaches life lessons. I wish to collect these stories from all over the world with the intention to share the advice given. I will make a video from the shared stories and if you feel that the stories you contribute can motivate, change or touch someone's life, please comment below and I will make your story into a video. Thanks for watching, stay safe always. Thank you.